not, little ones, you do you, and dread not the troubles of yesterday and the dread of tomorrow. And if you feel like there's nothing but darkness around you, know the sun may be setting here, but it's rising somewhere else. And behind those dark clouds, there's, the stars still, have, still shine bright. School is good, I tell myself again. I have not got upset today, and no one has looked at me in a way I feel too bad about. But the thing I don't like is how some teachers don't believe in mental illness. Because when my body is sick, it is an excuse, but when my sadness is acting up, I have no reason to miss school. I have no reason to hand in homework late. And the thing is, the thing I don't like is you need proof. My mom will not call in and say, I'm sorry my daughter is feeling sad today, so she can't go to school. Please excuse her. Please excuse her self-hatred. Please excuse her sadness. Please excuse herself. And I do not like, because some teachers will not accept mental illness as a reasonable excuse because her friends get sick too. You remember when you were a kid, right? When the world was compressed into the sandbox you played in, and the mud and the sun, it was bright. You remember ever sticky hands being immersed in an entire other worlds and lands, a book could keep you entertained for months. You remember phases of, I want to be a fireman, or I'll be a waitress, and even though you knew waitresses didn't wear aerial dresses, you didn't anyway. You remember making friends with the caterpillars and marrying the bugs on the sidewalk, flying and skidding down the hallway on the magical rug, because the waitress phase is an Aladdin one now. The color blue that drips from the cut to create the river pouring from your sockets, and once you look at all that you have lost, as someone that has put you through so much, feel the hate the strings of hatred you haven't you haven't realized until now once again i've cut loose so go ahead do us all a favor hide and stash away from your neighbor i think i'd rather have eyes stuck have my eyes stuck with glue so i wouldn't have to look at you so i tell you that the trees let go of beautiful leaves to me that's more interesting than you can ever see on tv the rivers flow like the odd young man on the street trying to make it creating fire creating passion Sometimes being alone in your own self-described meditation. Meditation, inner peace with yourself, meditation for the greater things. You see, when I was normal, I got made fun of. Now that I'm weird, people love me. They love how confident I am with makeup, clothes, piercings, hairs, hair, and attitude. But the only thing I'm confident of is, is correcting people who are rude. But the real question is, do you like yourself? Can you look in the mirror and be proud of what you see? That's the ultimate goal in life. Not to fall in love with somebody else, but to fall in love with the person you can control. You. A smile may give a hint on what you are feeling, but what you feel on the inside is what you feel overall. Life is an emotion, a feeling, a roller coaster, and now hold your breath, clench your fists, and take that risk. Wishing they never found the sour skittles. Awesome. Who's next? <laughs>